Hello, how to solve 25 power x plus 5 power x is equal to 20 to find the value of x. So first this 25 is 5 square bracket power x plus 5 power x is equal to 20. Then from here we will apply this rule which is a power m bracket power n is equal to a power m n is equal to a power n bracket power m. So we exchange the powers as in here m is inside the bracket here n is inside the bracket. So also here in our question we exchange the powers. So here it will be 5 power x bracket power 2 plus 5 power x is equal to 20. Then here 5 power x is common. So we let 5 power x is equal to y. Then here in equation it will be y square plus y is equal to 20. Then this 20 we take to the left side. So it will be y square plus y minus 20 is equal to 0. Now this is quadratic equation. So we we'll solve this by factorization. Whereas the product is equal to coefficient of y square is 1. 1 times constant negative 20 is negative 20. And the sum is equal to coefficient of y is 1. Therefore, to get here negative 20, it means it's the product of two factors, which is 5 and negative 4. So 5 times negative 4 is negative 20, and the sum of 5 and negative 4 is 1. Then, to get this y, so here, 1 times y is y. This is equal to 5 times y is 5y, Negative 4 times y is negative 4y. Therefore, we substitute this 5y minus 4y into here y. Then in our equation, it will be y square, then plus 5y minus 4y minus 20 is equal to 0. Then next step here, y is common. So we take y out of bracket. This divided by this is y. This divided by this is plus 5 bracket. Here negative 4 is common. Negative 4 out of bracket. This divided by this is y. This divided by this is plus 5 bracket is equal to 0. Then next step. Here y plus 5 is common. So we take y plus 5 out of bracket. Then times y minus 4. Bracket is equal to 0. Then in here we have two cases. Whereas y plus 5 is equal to 0. And another case, y minus 4 is equal to 0. Then here we take 5 to the right side. So it will be y is equal to negative 5. And here we take negative 4 to the right side. So y is equal to 4. But before, we let that 5 power x is equal to y. So here, but y is equal to 5 power x. Then 5 power x is equal to negative 5. But 5 power any number is positive. And this is negative. So positive cannot be equal to negative. So in this case is rejected. Now to solve in this case. Whereas y is equal to 5 power x. So here 5 power x is equal to 4. Then we apply log in both sides. So it will be log of 5 power x is equal to log of 4. Then this power of x will move to the base. So it will be x log of 5 is equal to log of 4. Then we divide by log of 5 in both sides. So this and this will cancel. Then x is equal to log of 4 over log of 5. Then this is equal to log of 4 is same as 2 power 2 over log of 5. Then here x is equal to this power of 2 will move to the base. So it will be 2 log of 2 over log of 
5. So, this can be the final answer in terms of logarithm. Or, if we can use calculator, here x is equal to 2 times log of 2 is 0 0.301 over log of 5 is 0 0.699. So this is equal to, this time this is 0 0.602 over 0 0.699. Then x is equal to this divided by this is 0 0.8. 6, 1, 2. So this is the value of x in our equation. Now to check if this value is correct from our problem, to check from the value of x is 0 0.8612. So we'll substitute the value of x in these powers. So it will be 25 power 0 0.8612 plus 5 power 0 0.8612 is it equals to 20. In here, 25 power of this is 15.992 plus 5 power of this is 3.999. This is it equals to 20. So, the sum of this is 19.991 which is approximately equals to 20. So when we round off into one decimal place here it will be 20 is equal to 20 as left side is equal to right side therefore is true for this value of x. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.